Hello guys, me Austin Dawson here, and Super Bowl 53 is on our way this Sunday on CBS, 6.30 p.m. is the New England Patriots, Tom Brady, Edelman, Gronk, against the Rams, the Los Angeles Rams, Todd Gurley, yeah, Jared Goff. Incredible, man. This is this is gonna be a great Super Bowl, man. But I don't like. Th there were some bad calls in both games, okay? Which the R the Rams against the Saints, yes, that one call should have been pass interference. Clearly, that was a bad call. But there was a call that should have been that that there was a face mask on Jared Goff that should have been called. There was also t a couple of times that the Saints could have went for a touchdown, but instead they kicked a couple field goals. They had another opportunity in overtime, so now that I think about it, at first I was saying, okay, yeah, it's rigged. I was saying it was, that game was rigged, Saints should have won it, but now that I look back on it, if you now think about it, it wasn't really rigged, the Saints had another, yes, that, that was a horrible call, the worst call I have, I have seen in a sports game, you know, at a time like that, like, the Super Bowl was on the line. But, I just think, in my opinion, the Saints had a chance. Drew Brees threw an interception. What was it? Second down and long? Like, you, you can't be making those. You can't. Like, he was pressured. He's thrilled. That was a bad pass. You can't be doing that. You can't. Which, that pass was intercepted. The Rams went on to kick a field goal. It was a long field goal. I think it was 50-something. I don't exactly remember how, how long it was. They made it. They won. 26 to 23 in overtime. Was it 26? Yeah, I think it was 26-23. Yeah, and they went on the, the win. And the Saints, they did not look like the team they were this year. The last two games they won against the Eagles, they weren't. They didn't look like themselves. And against the Rams. At first they did. Like, they looked like they were going to dominate. And then they just went cold. What was it, 14 nothing? Like, I just don't understand, like... The Saints, you gotta, you gotta be better. You gotta play better. Drew Brees, you gotta be better. He's a great, outstanding quarterback. They, they have a great team, but you gotta play better, man. Like I think the Rams deserve where they're at. I think so, in my opinion. And same with the Patriots against the Chiefs. What a game! Fourteen nothing. They had a lead in the first half, and then, and then the Chiefs came back. It was um twenty it was a twenty eight twenty four Patriots scored a touchdown to take the lead, and then the Chiefs tied it up with a field goal, win the overtime. You know how Tom Brady is, man. When when he gets the ball, the other team ain't touching it, man. And that's definitely what happened. He was the only was making those passes nobody does, man. And yes, that, that one pass interference call never should have happened. Now I'm a Patriots fan. I'm gonna admit it. That that never should have been pass interference. You know, on Tom Brady, never should have, never should have called and called. Now that catch up, maybe should never been a catch. I feel like that was a catch, but either way, I think Tom Brady would have still scored a touchdown anyway. Like, tell me what, tell me, you know, explain me how the Patriots are not going to win that game. And also, Chiefs fans who are, I feel like, who are crying, score, you know, score in the first half, and maybe you could have won that game. And also, that guy wasn't offsides. You know, I was dumb now. The interception though that, that Grunk probably should have caught was a little high, but it ended up being a flag on the Chiefs, which the guy was over the line. So the call back, Patriots he landed away in that game, 37 to 31 in overtime. Now the Super Bowl, Tom Brady is 375 to 570 attempts. 4,355 yards, 29 touchdowns, 11 interceptions, and 97.7 passing rate. Jared Goff, 364 to 561 attempts, 4,688 yard, thousand yards, 30, 32 touchdowns, 12 interceptions, and, uh, and uh, 100 point, 101 Point one passing rate. Now, clearly, Jared Goff got be better numbers than Tom Brady. 
Yeah, they're kind of similar. They kind of look close, but he's got a bit better numbers, which I don't think it matters. Sorry, Mom, I'm getting tired. The Pagers are 11 and 5. The Rams are 13 and 3. The Rams, I salute you. You guys, great team. You guys deserve, deserve to be here. I think it's gonna be a great Super Bowl. They faced before, so this will be the second. This will be the second time in two years that the Pagers have faced a team that they already have faced in the Super Bowl. Last year was the Eagles, and they lost. I think, in my opinion, the Pagers will win this. Will win this game. I think the final score of this game will go in the overtime. I think the score will go will be thirty one. The 20, the 24, New England. It will go to overtime, which will be the second time in Super Bowl history, which you know what happened last time. The Patriots came back to, down 25 points. Rams could, I mean, not the Rams, Atlanta could have just ran the ball, wasted the clock, but you know, loaded the game, Patriots came back, got the ball in overtime, won it. And I think, I don't think the Rams are really going to blow the game, but I think. There's going to be some interesting plays that they probably could have made that could have gotten more points. I think for the Rams to win this game, they have to take pressure on Brady. They got to, have to take pressure on him. They got to make him throw an interception. I think that will happen. I think he will throw an interception. But I think Tom Brady will get over four. Will get over 400 yards passing. I think he will get two touchdowns. I think Michelle will get a couple. Will get um, will get one or two touchdowns. I think Grunk will get some touches. Edelman for sure will get some touches. Doors, I think it was Doors. I forgot what that one um that one dude's name. It was a wide receiver for New England. I think he'll get some touches as well. Tom Brady, I think he will be dealing. He will be throwing. He will be throwing, as he always does. The goat, the greatest, has ever done it. And I believe if he wins the Super Bowl. He will have more Super Bowls than any other player in NFL history. I don't know who has the most. I'm not sure. You guys can maybe let me know, but I'm not sure who has the most. I know he has the most in QB in QB history, but this should be interesting, man. Especially like how young like Jared Goff is and how and how young um, Sean McVay is. Great coach, Jared Goff, great quarterback, Bill Belichick, one of the greatest. To ever do it as a head coach. It's going to be really good. I mean, it's like young it gets old. It's going to be great. great. I think it's going to be a really good Super Bowl. The commercials, I think it will be iffy. I kind of saw like some of the league commercials. They were, they were fine, I guess. But I'm here to watch the Patriots. The Patriots. Tom Brady. I'm here to watch him, bro. And Michigan won yesterday, man. Yeah, I guess Ohio State. I'm happy about that one. Can't wait for Sunday, man. Who got cheering for? I know most people are cheering for the Rams with bet against us. Bet against us. You know, I don't really love that people are hating so much, but you know what? Just how it is, man. Well, guys, I think it's going to be 31-24 in overtime. I think that um, he won't throw it in. I think Michelle will get the game when he touched down. I think Tom Brady will definitely get excited for that to win his sixth Super Bowl. I think he'll win. I think if he wins this Super Bowl, he will get another one. I really believe that. I really believe he will get one more Super Bowl. That will be it. Who knows how many he'll be in, but I definitely think if he wins this one, he'll get one more. Well, guys, if you guys enjoyed this video, please drop a like. Follow me on Instagram Twitter. Let me know who you guys picking. Picking the Los Angeles Los Rams or are you picking the New England Patriots? Well, guys, we got to have a Wonderful day, and go Pats, go Tom Brady, go Blue, Tom Brady, the GOAT. Peace.